Hi, this is Mr. Quiz Vid Kid, and um, in this video, I'll be doing how to breed mealworms, as you can probably tell from the title up there. Um, breeding mealworms is quite easily done. All you will need is a tub, no, three tubs, um, some oatmeal, or porridge, or whatever you want to call it. Um, in one of two of the tubs, you're going to put um, oatmeal, porridge, I'm going to say oatmeal for now, oatmeal in them, and then in the other tub you're just going to leave empty. Also you're going to need a banana and like something like a potato or carrots, and you're going to put them in the two tubs that you put the oatmeal in. Right, and you're going to want to start off with about 500 mealworms. My tubs this six quart tub and I will bring the camera over, there is dozens in there. Right, that yep, I think you can see that. Uh, sorry if you can't. And um, you're gonna put the oatmeal in there and they have finished it. Uh, there are only a few of here. Right, now in the other tub put that one on there for now. The other tub, you're going to want to leave it and if you can get a divider, which is something you put in it, if we use this one for another example, put in it, separate it into little bits and then it wants to go in half like that again. Um, that would be good for the pupae, but you don't need to. Um, find, I don't know if I can find the pupae. Right, it's gone. Oh, yeah. There we are, beautiful. Uh, this is a pupa. They look. Ooh, he's ripping the bubble. They look like that. There, just up on my finger. They look like that. And, yep, they stay like that. It takes about two days, three, four days to get like that um, and then they will some, soon turn into beetles which beetles wise you will need to put them in another tub bear in mind beetles like the darkness I've got mine in this yellow um, 12 quart tub with no lid um, and the beetle is here Uh, a couple of them in there actually. There we are. There's a couple of, in, of them in there. And once they go from beetles into the pupae, keep them in something like that, or as I said, the containers, which is split. Or if you have um, locust crickets or anything and they come in them tubs, you can put them in there, that's a really easy way. Um, and then they turn into beetles. And then they'll go through the whole cycle again and you just need to keep moving them in tubs. But that's about it. Cheers for watching and subscribe to me.